Yeah. So you have to go in between the blue and yellow? Stay to the left of the blue. All right, I'm uh, here at the freshman uh, Metro, freshman sophomore race. Uh, get to see some of the youngsters run today. Uh, Emily Headley should be a big favorite, I would believe, for Olympia. She was a runner-up in the state meet in 4A last year. On the boys' side, I'm, it should be a good race between the Colonial boys and the uh, Olympia boys, I think. Uh, the Colonial boys have a, a couple of kids in there, and Olympia has a, a sophomore named Sergio Santiago and Desi Ferreira, both run varsity, and then uh, same with Colonial, so uh, we'll see how it goes, but uh, it should be good races on both sides. I'm looking for the Olympia girls on the girls' side. I don't know, the, uh, maybe Winter Park might be able to get in there, but, but we'll see. We're getting ready to uh, start the boys right now, so we'll see at the end. Okay, we're at uh, getting ready to start the boys part of the uh, freshman sophomore race, Metro. Uh, again, uh, looking for Sergio Santiago from Olympia and the Olympia team against the Colonial boys, I think led by Anthony Hurd. So, this should be fun. They're off. We're at the four minute point of the boys freshman sophomore 2012 Metro Conference Champion or Metro Championship. Got about 400 meters short of a mile at this point. Maybe 200 more like it. Winter Park in the lead, followed by Sergio Santiago of Olympia. They are past the one mile at 5.08. Okay, we have a Winter Park guy, number first, coming through in about five. Sergio Santiago from Olympia's second. It's like, uh, Winter Park has got three up there. Olympia's got two. Here comes the pack. A couple more Winter Park guys. Looks like Winter Park right now. Olympia, there's their fourth. Or third, I'm sorry. Colonial's got two by. Colonial's third and fourth. Olympia's fourth and fifth. So it looks like Winter Park. Colonial and uh, Olympia. Okay, here we go. We're coming down to the, uh, it's 1427 right now, coming down to the last couple minutes. Looks like we have a Lake Nona runner up front. I'm not exactly sure who that is. And then there's a pretty good spread back to, uh, it looks like uh, Sergio Santiago and probably Heard from Colonial. And then they, they or that might be Winter Park. But Lake Nona, he is taking it out hard. He's got a pretty good lead going on. Looks like the fight is actually going to be for second place. And it's a uh, battle between uh, Sergio Santiago, Heard from Colonial, and a uh, runner from Winter Park, the runner from Winter Park was leading early. We'll have to see how this plays out. And then we go back to the next little pack. Here's Desi Ferreira. And that looks like the second Colonial runner. So we got two for uh, Olympia and two for Colonial, one for Winter Park right now. 
been a long ways back. I'm going out on the leader now. Uh, where is he? White shirt. Yep. Roberts from uh, Lake Nona, 1630. It's a uh, he's really running a, a great race here. He's coming by. He's probably going to come in. He's 1638, 1630, 1640, 1641. Here comes Sergio Santiago from from Olympia, coming in second. He's going to break 17 as are the Colonial. Here's a good, good race for third between Colonial and Winter Park. And it looks like Winter Park nipped him. All under 17. So that was pretty good times there. So now we're going looking more at the team. Here comes Desi Ferreira from Olympia. And here comes a Colonial runner. Looks like Desi went off course a little bit. But it's going to be Colonial. So Colonial's got two in. Olympia has two in. Dale, 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 dale,